Hey, what's up you guys, Mr. Awesome here, and welcome to the first video of 2021. As you guys have probably heard, Nintendo has bought next level games, and dude, this is crazy. So on January 5th, 2021, Nintendo of Japan announced via press release that they acquired Next Level Games. Next Level Games was already a second party developer for Nintendo and if you look up their developed games, most of them are exclusive to Nintendo besides some notable ones like the Captain America game and Spider-Man game. But other than that, Next Level Games mostly made Nintendo games for the most part of their existing career. And with this upcoming acquisition, Nintendo's done. Honestly, I'm very excited because this will provide more funding for next level game projects, which in turn means more Luigi's Mansion titles for the future and the possible return for Super Mario Strikers. And maybe another Punch-Out game for the Nintendo Switch. And trust me, if you played the Wii version of it, you know that that version is really good. It added a lot of personality and character to these Punch-Out characters and just imagine that on Switch. To me, I could just honestly flat out say it would be just as good if not a million times better. Next Level Games is a super duper talented studio. I mean look at Luigi's Mansion 3. I love this game. Luigi's Mansion 3, I can honestly say, is the best Luigi's Mansion game to date. You can tell that this studio loves Nintendo, since each project they have their hands on, dude, they nail it, it's amazing. The Mario characters, when they appear in next level game titles, they actually have a personality versus their blank canvas personality seen in certain modern titles like Mario Party and Mario Kart. Well granted Mario Kart really isn't a bland personality, but come on, compare this from Super Mario Strikers to this from Mario Kart 8. There's a difference there, and I kind of like when characters show off their personality like this. Wouldn't it be kind of crazy if Next Level Games got their hands on the Mario & Luigi franchise? Think of it, as unfortunate as it is that Nintendo didn't buy Alpha Dream, Nintendo did buy Next Level Games, and if Next Level Games were to pick up Mario & Luigi, it would be fantastic in my opinion. It could be a possibility since they picked up the Luigi's Mansion series from Nintendo and they picked up Metroid Prime from Retro Studios. And honestly seeing how Luigi acts and reacts in Luigi's Mansion 3 makes me want to see it done in a comedy RPG like the Mario & Luigi games. Honestly thank god Nintendo bought next level games and didn't pull a Rare Wars situation because we all know what Rare is up to these days. Nothing bad of course, you know, Sea of Thieves is lit and all from what I'm hearing, but we really want Banjo Kazooie and Conquered Bad Fur Day and stuff like that. And unfortunately, as I mentioned before, look at Alpha Dream. Nintendo should have bought Alpha Dream as well, but they didn't. I personally am super hopeful and excited for this acquisition and seeing what the team produced now with their with their current resources was just mind blowing. Dude, I compared Luigi's Mansion 3 to Super Mario Odyssey and look at it. Just there's such love and quality to next level game projects. And just imagine with Nintendo's resources, dude, they're going to have more money on top of them to make games. And obviously more money means more quality, so more money isn't a bad thing if you ask me. Super excited what the team could produce in the future. Hopefully Mario Strikers comes back. I generally like Super Mario Strikers. I'm not really that good at it, but I liked it. I liked it a lot, especially the Wii version. That was a really good game. Here's two. Next level games and their future projects. Hey, before we reach the end of the video, let me ask you guys. Do you guys like this type of video? I don't really cover news that much on the channel, but this was pretty fun to do because I just got to voice my opinion and I always like to have a discussion in the comment section. So if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know, please, in the comment section. Um, I, you know, I'm always open to criticism. So if you guys have any construction criticism to give, please share it because that's the only way this channel is only going to get better and better thanks for watching this video guys shout out to the mr awesome members for supporting the channel monthly you guys have really made a lot of things come true for this channel and it's only going to go up from here i'm very hopeful and positive about it 2021 will be a very different year 
And shout outs to those lovely people wearing the Mr. Awesome merch. You guys look pretty stunning if I do say so myself. As always, please take care guys. Wear a mask and stay golden.